is a very deep dive with a lot of repercussions to that. Come up too fast, bubbles will form inside your blood, inside your tissues and cause ill effects. To get to 90 metres, you'd be looking at four or five minutes to get down there. It's very dark because you're very deep, so there's very little light penetration. And you come down in the dark and you start to slowly realise there's some shape coming up ahead underneath you. The atmosphere at the wreck when you arrive there is quite spooky. The very first thing I noticed was there was a lot of net. It was basically rope netting, uh, so very heavy, but it does cover everything. The problem was that we were not 100% sure that the, that the ship is Karlsruhe. So we decided to go and try and find the name written on the ship which in a more luxurious ship would be bronze or brass letters riveted into the hull. As we neared the bow, the, the amount of netting seemed to increase. And what you don't want to do as a diver is try to get under it, because that risks you being trapped, tangled within it. To be able to uncover the letters, we had to cut some of the nets away. It wasn't easy, but eventually, once the nets dropped away, we could finally see what lay beneath. What became apparent was that the, the bridge area was heavily damaged. There's a huge hole in the middle of the ship. 